but what will be, will be. As you can see, I have my Batman t-shirt on, but it's not the Batman clutch, but it's something related. So this is uh, the Gotham clutch. So I've got to thank Justin and Chase for coming up with all these cool names because Batman is, is one of my guys, you know. Don't tell anyone, but you won't see me and Batman in the same room together. Anyway, back to today's broadcast. Um, so this is the Gotham clutch, and um, I'm, I'm kind of, I'm building on that whole sort of leopard clown um, project, if you like. So this was the leopard clown bred to a pastel banana het clown female. I was wrong. Uh, a couple of the babies I ID'd in the clutch, which let me tell you, it is very difficult sometimes to ID babies within a clutch, uh, especially when you're just cutting them and they're inside the egg, it's very difficult. However, I was pleasantly surprised. Um, you, you know what, I'm just gonna shut up. Uh, let's check out the video, let's, cut the, uh, let, let's get into the egg cutting video and then let's check out the cleanup video. Okay guys, as this is another clown clutch, uh, I'm gonna be clown heavy this season, not complaining. Uh, this was the leopard clown bred to the banana pastel head clown female. So we've got seven eggs um, that have not picked yet, but the clutch that was due the day after this has picked. So as a matter of caution, I just want to cut them open, make sure everything's okay, which I'm sure they will be. Um, let's just check again, do our little tests. Oh yeah, they're coming away dead easy. As you can see, and let's feel, yeah, we can feel babies in there. So let's go with this one. So in theory, you know, whatever's gonna be is gonna be, as long as they're all healthy. Everything that's not a visual claim will be 100% het. First out of the gate is a what looks to be a leopard or a pastel leopard. Obviously, 100% head clean. Looks to be just a pastel, 100% head clown. Come on, let's get some banana leopard clowns. Okay, that's our first clown. This looks like an ordinary clown. Never get bored of hatching clowns. Ah, oh, terrible odds on this clutch so far. That looks to be like a pastel. Don't see leopard. So that looks like a pastel head clown. Three eggs left, no bananas so far. Fingers crossed, eh? That's a leopard clown. Hopefully you guys can see the difference. So we just need that with banana. And again, guys, this is, you know, this, it's all down to the odd gods, you know. Um, I've had some fantastic odds so far this season. I'm not gonna complain at all. Um, obviously, I'd love to have a banana leopard uh, clown, but what will be, will be.
pasta there looks to be another pastel or leopard pastel pet clown come on no bananas yet nuts but this is what we work with these are the odds Okay, so we've got a banana, it is a clown, and I can see pastel. Um, I don't think it's a leopard pastel banana clown. I think that is just a straightforward pastel clown. But we'll see once they come out of the eggs. Like I said, guys, as long as they're healthy, um, then I'm happy. So there we have it. Um, let's check these babies once they've come out of the egg. So now these babies are out of the egg, uh, let's take a closer look uh, of what we've got. Um, if you remember from the egg cutting video, we only hit one banana, but I'm gonna leave that till last. I'm gonna go over uh, what we have. Um, there is something else going on with this clutch. Um, I suspect blade um, or something else, but I'm not sure. And I'm gonna show you guys why in a moment. So let's go into the pastels first. Didn't do the greatest with these odds, but boy, are there some stunners. First out of the gate is a pastel. Everything that's not a visual is 100% heck clown, guys. Um, just beautiful blushing that I'm seeing in this clutch, which is really unusual and unique. Um, this is the first time really I've looked at them. Um, but again, beautiful combo. But again, beautiful animal to have. Just see if it's male or female. So this one looks to be a female. But again, beautiful pattern, beautiful color. Let's take a look at another pastel. This one. It seems to be very active. So again, Beautiful bold colours. Um, looks like it's going to be quite a bright baby. But again, 100% heck clown. That one looks to be a female as well. So the last pastel in the clutch is this one. And this one, as you can see, looks to be very bright and again we've got more of a blushed out head and again that crazy blushing uh, coming up don't know if it's blade or, or whatever or heck for another gene i don't know but i do think there's something going on with the leopard clown male but hopefully i can try and prove something out with him this season so again beautiful pastel fe uh, male or female i don't know because it's only literally just come out of the egg so i'm not going to mess with it too much um so i wanted to get these guys cleaned up we've still got a bit of umbilicus as you can see just to absorb but i wanted to get it in a clean environment which is what the tubs i'll put them in is uh is clean and tidy without the vermiculite in there so beautiful animal stunning okay this is where the funky stuff starts to happen so let's have a look at this leopard pastel 100 percent heck clown and again, look at the back, how bright the head is, and look at the dorsal, how much the blushing is coming. Now I've produced leopard uh, pastels before, but this one certainly looks different to me. So beautiful, bold black, and again, we've got the, the typical gold coming up with the leopard. Pretty much clear belly, beautiful wacky pattern on the tail. But again, a beautiful combo. So I'm not sure if this is a male or female. Let's have a quick look. This looks to be a female. I always double check the sex again once they've shed out, but I just like to get an indication of uh, what's going on. So a beautiful female. Let's go on to the clowns. So as I said, 
I got this wrong. I thought there was a normal clown and a leopard clown in this clutch, in the two that we cut. And as you can see, let's have a look at this clown. This clown is what I would class to be kind of a typical clown, how it's patterns all there and the alien eyes. But look at the head and the neck on this. This is just crazy. So this one in the egg, I, I presumed was a clown. The other one I thought was a leopard clown. But look at the head on that, guys. Just really pronounced, really detailed. You know, the outlining is there. You know, it, it just, they just look different to me, you know. Um, again, really interesting to see. And again, the umbilical cord, as you can see, we've got some vermiculite, so we'll get that washed off. And that part there will probably just end up dropping off. So again, a very unique looking clown. Um, I don't think I'm gonna keep the two clowns back, but very unique looking indeed. So this was the one I thought was a leopard clown. And the reason for that was all I saw uh, in the egg was this part here, which does look very leopardy indeed. And the colors are more towards a leopard clown than a normal clown. But again, look at the head. Look at that spot in the middle of the head. I don't know if there's blade involved, or like I said, whether it's head for another gene. Real busy sort of belly end, I, I don't know. So I'm not sure what I'm gonna do with this guy or girl, but very interesting nonetheless. I might have been wrong with that one, but I was definitely wrong with this one as well. Um, and a pleasant surprise with this one, guys. So as you can tell, this is the only banana in the clutch. And what we have here is a pastel leopard banana clown. And the mum was the pastel banana head clown, uh, but I can tell you it is a male. And because it's a male and it's come from a female, it should be a female maker. So very pleased with uh, the outcome on this. The only banana in the clutch and it's all the genes in one combo. So this dude will probably end up stopping and taking the replacement of the father, which is the leopard clown. That's if I don't hit a Batman in the next coming week. <laughs> but let's see, but like I said, what an absolutely awesome combo. Again, pastel, leopard, banana, clown, male, male, uh, female maker, and again, just a beautiful animal to have in the HQ. Stunning. So that is a pastel Gotham. So really pleased we're hitting some, um, we're hitting some Batman themed combos this season. But yeah, beautiful. But again, guys, thanks for tuning in. Thanks for all your support. Love and respect you all. Take care. And I'll see you guys in the next one. That money clip was not